Hello everybody, how's it going? My name is Inkai's, welcome back to Inkai's Plays The Shrouded Isle. So, uh, apologies, as I said, an uh, arbitrary timer here. You know, continue. I think we are in the spring of Yad, exactly. How Yosefka was getting extremely mad at me, which is understandable, I killed two of the members back to back. Um, I had, I had cause though okay i didn't do it just cause i had real cause all right so it is a yosefka event to my major giant surprise because last time i was like there's no way they're gonna give us two yosefka things back to back but it seems like they haven't this might be my chance to mend this nonsense so yeah let's see Danik Yosefka arrives concerned. He confesses deep love for two people. I mean, you guys have a lot of fervors. <laughs> so, and must choose one to marry, one to kill, and one to fuck. Before Chernobog awakens. One makes him happy. The other inspires him to be a better person. Mm -hmm. Happiness is fleeting, virtue is eternal. If it is not clear to your heart, perhaps neither is right. Ask the elders of House Yusufka, it is not my affair. See, the thing is, this will encourage discipline, this will have a uh, unknown effect, and this will make them like me a little better, so maybe it will save me from them being so rebellious. Danik groans and trudges away, but House Yusufka is pleased with your sign of respect. They are still not cool with me. Yeah. They're not cool. They're pissed. <laughs> they are very pissed. So we're gonna have to like, when it comes to the um, different months of this season, we're gonna have to favor them a lot, get their approval up by a whole ton. Okay. So what do we basically need? We need kind of kind of need obedience. I kind of need their approval. So if I can get somebody from this house that I can use to also increase obedience without negatively affecting anything else, it would be perfect. And then the same thing for Yosefka's and the Blackborns. That would be very nice. So I'd say. Let's take a look here, obviously. Obedience going up is good. I don't want penitence to get, to get affected like that. That is too much. Obedience goes up, but then there's a un, an unknown negative vice. He lacks fervor. <clears throat> Which is okay, especially if we're gonna have these guys have their round of their month without any sort of interference from any other house. I think he might be a, an alright choice. Except I'm not sure how negatively he's gonna affect Fervor. I remember that it was like a whole chunk. But we're gonna recover that when I give yourself their chance. So, Andre... You are, again, an advisor. And it's good, we're also trying to, you know, work toward finding who the coward might be. So, let's see. Yosefkas, hi! Sorry! <laughs> womp womp. You guys hate me. Really? You guys have nobody who can increase fervor? I mean... We're gonna go with Kegney once. And then probably once with Blackborn. And then once with Yosef Go. So if knowing too much, it's not gonna be too bad. But you might 
You're my only hope when it comes to somebody who can actually boost fervor from your freaking house. God. Okay, Cadwells, you've been you've been great so far. Honestly, I've I've I don't have a lot of complaints about your house except for gluttony. You know, why don't you tell me more about Mr. Miko? Miko, he's dull. <laughs> You're so dull. You would help out with ignorance a little bit, which will take a hit if I go with House Yosefka's advisor. I would like you to be part of. Wait, hold on. What about penitence? Um, see, but this is gonna give me a chance to find out his vice. But what if his vice is reduce obedience or fervor? Well, that's the risk we have to take. Because the virtue is pretty decent. It's not, I mean, it is a minor virtue, but there are mi minor virtues for like plus five. But it's a plus 10, so... Miko? You're so dull! Effersons, you've also been totally fine, except for this incident of this kleptomaniac! What kind of family are you raising, you... Hmm. So-and-so's? Inquire! Wait. Yeah, inquire into the mama. Nadic. Answers most questions with strange sounds and animal noises. Oh god. She's very uneducated, which is good for ignorance. And I also want to learn more about her. She's, uh... She, she's kind of suspicious-ish. <laughs> I just hope that her vice doesn't come back to haunt me. Alright, Blackborns. Hello. You, your disobedience hurt more than your charismatic trait helped. So, I'm not sure. We don't want to mess with obedience, especially if I want to give them a round. I want them to be able to boost obedience. You're the only person who might be able to boost obedience, except for Svetlana, who's dead <laughs> so I might go back to another no oh man but what are you gonna hurt I think we can go with Zoya just a safe advisor very safe I'll find out about Iva's or Eva Iva Eva Iva we'll find out about her vice right after this all right let's let's start this uh, season and see how things go okay you guys hate me and I want to know more about this guy so let's start with you Yeah, give me all the boost in the world. Oh. Well, full of fervor. I mean, look at that. But the this is a whatever vice this is. It's a major one. It just <laughs> wiped out my ignorance. Uh, Miesha urged the laborers in. Uh, yep, we made monuments. Virtue rumor. It's rumored to be full of fervor. Spends extra time at the monument construction sites. Interesting. Pulls a town on their thoughts about a library. You want to make a library in my town of ignorant folks? No. April.
they're still rebellious. If I go with this guy, my ignorance is gonna get wrecked. Boost obedience. You're gonna hurt fervor a lot. But you're gonna help ignorance a lot. These guys are now neutral, so how about go with these guys as well? It's gonna be good for ignorance, it's gonna be good for both of these guys. It'll put him at satisfied. So Andre Burns books. He found one world book or one old world book to burn. Follows every suggestion I make. Was discovered to be lazy. Negative ten fervor. Okay, so it's it's a discovery. It's no longer just a rumored one. All right, what about you? Okay. Average outcome. No problems. Rumor to be lacking fervor. That's not good. Okay, for this last month, I need someone who can contribute to ignorance a lot. And I think I want you. And you. What if I do you? Oh, you gonna remain rebellious? Are you kidding me? Okay. Great outcome. Discovered a cache of old world books. They burn merrily in the town square. Uh, virtue was discovered. He's unquestioning, so obedience went up by a ton. Sticks to my side, except when sent out to fulfill my orders. And he claims to be too exhausted to join all the month's ceremonies. So fervor went down, but that's totally fine. We... This is supposed to change. Why has it not changed? Average outcome. Right, virtue discovery. He's actually a singer. Increase a special or singer. So it was singer the whole time, not singer like flame and fire and stuff. Miyashi creates a special chorus to sing our Lord's hymns. Okay. Satisfied? Dissatisfied? I'm okay with dissatisfied. It's totally fine. Penitence is okay. Discipline's through the roof. We have. Three out of five satisfied houses who are going to give us good inquiries. And now, the time to sacrifice. Miesha! No, I'm just kidding. Just, just, just kidding. I think it's got to be him. I, I just clicked on him just to check the stats real quick. Plus 20, plus 20. They're all plus 20. We can't let ignorance get hurt. What if I kill one of the Effersons? Really?
What about killing the Cagney? Obedience will drop. Fervor will go up. And they'll be outraged. Bang. He was lazy. <laughs> Sorry. Sacrifice for minor sin. House Kegney simmers with quiet resentment. Negative 50 approval. But they are nowhere near rebellious. But they are dissatisfied. So now we have two dissatisfied, two satisfied, one neutral. The villagers speak of Andre as a holy martyr perishing for the greater good. Fervor, negative obedience. It's fine. Tis summer. No inquiries. That's fine. We need to boost ignorance. Um, therefore, I gotta go with somebody who might have something like that. Discipline can take a hit. I think we're gonna appoint Casimir as the advisor. The Yosefkos are doing a little better. They're not A-OK. -okay, but it's... Uh, we're not gonna go with Miesha anymore. Because that... That was hurting ignorance a lot. So... Whoa, what? Oh yeah, you're dissatisfied too, no inquiries. Therefore, not gonna take anybody who knows too much either. Actually, Danik, I think, is the, the one I like. Hello! It is me who calls to you, fool. It's good that you guys have at least one person who can, who we know for a fact, has a disciplinal, disciplinary, disciplinary sort of minor virtue. Um, inquire into her, actually. That was too much. I also need to boost obedience, so if you happen to have something that boosts obedience, please surprise me. Bloop! After six. Now I have come to choose an advisor from your house of idiots. We need somebody obedient. Are you obedient? Ivan or Ivan? Well, it's okay. We still learn more. Mm. I think maybe Milos. This will be so fun! Shut up. It's hilarious. We're in House Blackboard, and the parents of this house of obedience are disobedient. Full of fervor. So you have. Nobody right now who can encourage obedience. Are you kidding me? I gotta get obedience from other houses. I need obedience to come from these two.
What if I don't want an advisor from them? <laughs> this sucks. Um, sure. Your advisors suck. Or candidates. Um, we need to get ignorance and obedience out of these two houses, so... We're gonna hope for the best. Good. This is, I think, the optimum situation that we can produce. It's it was this was tough. This was actually hard. <laughs> this was the hardest decision that I had to make. Um. So yeah, first of all, you guys. Average outcome, scoured the town and found one book to burn, had an unknown impact on our community. Discipline went down by a lot. Average outcome, discovered to be dull, which is great. Let's not use satisfy with these guys, though. If I can. Jeez. Yes, one of them was obedient. That's good. That's very good. Average outcome. Sees forbidden stuff. Something, yeah, well, we know about that. So we know that she has an obedient sort of um, virtue. And he affected penitence negatively. We discovered him to be childlike. It's not a huge boost. And he just did average. Forever dropped. Why? Penitence take a hit. Ferro goes up. Discipline takes a hit. Ignorance goes up. Discipline takes a hit. Ignorance goes up. And they will remain satisfied. If I if I hadn't selected them. The negative uh, points from this round, this this month, would have outweighed the positives, and they would have gone down. But they're gonna oh jeez, that's my timer. They're gonna remain satisfied with us. He's not gonna dip into unsatisfied territory, and we're not gonna lose these guys either. So this is this is pretty good. 
Just gotta hope for the best. Average outcome. Could have been better, honestly. Obviously. He is actually Slovenly. Leaves the cathedral in a mess after ceremony. Discipline's going down. Average outcome. Okay. And he's a flirt. So you did it, huh? You went with another lover. Average outcome. Fervor is pretty good. And he's discovered to be a weasel. Really? Neutral? Satisfied? 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 Neutral. Perfect. Perfect. It's actually really good. Finish. Uh, I don't know who to kill. Uh, oh my god. Shit. They'll be rebellious. I can just wipe out House Yosef Go. <laughs> Rebuild from scratch again. Um, we're going to lose discipline. Aren't we? See, the thing is, at least we had we know his vice. They're, but they're forgivable. <laughs> Can I like spare, or is this like the close option? Is there a difference? Oh, that's like the close button. Hmm. This is extremely difficult. Um, I don't want to lose any ignorance. But nobody will be rebellious. I mean, nobody will be rebellious here either. But I don't know how this is going to affect discipline. You know what? Screw it. Goodbye. Sacrifice for minor sin. House Cadwell simmers with quiet resentment. That's fine. Uh, okay, plus five for everybody else. The villagers wonder whether any soul is safe. Ignorance goes up, obedience goes down. Okay, obedience needs emergency help. So does discipline. So does the house Cadwell in general. So we're doing pretty horribly with Yosefka Cadwell and yeah, that's, that's about it. But everybody's in a negative mostly. Just have the effort since we're so overjoyed to be alive. But anyway, next episode we're gonna check out the letter and redo the cycle and see how it goes. This game has multiple endings, so I'm pretty excited to get to the end of it and do more. But thank you so much for your time and attention as always, and make sure you leave a thumbs up on the video if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.